Hi, I wanted to make such a collection for so long and finally I have created a tiny piece of it. This time, I used forms without any bottom, like in frames, but to avoid leaking enough resin out of them, I made a layer of resin on perimeter and glued them to the punched pocket. Thus, when the resin was hard, the punched pocket became a transparent bottom for our pendants. It means that we can pour in the resin and are not afraid about any leakings, and the punch pocket we will remove just a bit later. I place the twig, cut it according to the size, fill in the base and then put there the coniferous twig. To be honest, I don't know how these plants are called, but I think it's high time to learn how to distinguish them. To make some magic, I decided to add a bit of craft glitter. The second form is very deep, so it's possible to make a whole bush in it by gradually putting the twigs in a small amount of resin. Don't pour too much, because it makes twigs float, and we need to only fix them at the first stage and wait till the resin have already hardened. Next, I continued working on my things, but the camera got tired and stopped recording, and I, being so burned away, didn't even notice it. So, this is how our two accessories look like. Speaking about the third one, I cut off a twig according to the form and as well as in the triangle, I put it on the resin and waited till it was dry. Removing the punch pocket and now we get an even surface on the back. This time, the forms allowed me to attach the chains before the final filling and that's why I took the pliers. For this very pendant, I took a figure chain and put it into the base. The open work pendant I decided not to just hang on on a jump ring, but on this bale. The chains which I bought were already with the jump rings and clasps, but this ring didn't manage to fit through. So, I removed it and then put it back again. And the third pendant I decided to make as less open work as possible, because there was glitter already, so I just took the jump ring and attached the pendant with the chain. Now we can make the upper layer. In the future, I really want to continue this collection and add some pine coats, bark and other forest things. 
I already found such small pine cones in France, so now I cannot wait to pour the resin into something again. I hope you like this video. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them. If you have any suggestions, please write them. And I love you this much. Bye.